There ain't no telling where they'll go And it's nothing short of a propose Well, they're out there fighting when they should be writing Settle up for adventure rodeo What is this peaceful signature? Hey there, all you cool cats and kittens. Welcome to the Adventure Rodeo. <laughs> Where we like to sit around and work out what's going on, man. We've gone very lo-fi. We are now <laughs> cool video games to study to. Uh... So today we're doing a single player uh, Brodeo with Steve along in the passenger seat because there was a new game out that's gotten a lot of interest called uh, Cassette Beasts that's definitely not Pokemon. Wink, wink. <laughs> uh -oh. Cassette Beasts, I thought this was going to be some kind of indie band thing. Is, is that what's not going on? Is this not some uh, obnoxious college kids starting their first band? Uh, so this is basically, I, I did play through the character creation bit so I could um, kind of get through the setup things and save y'all from that. And in the course of it, I learned that I have washed up on an island uh, with monsters that can be beaten when I use my cassette player in a way that will be demonstrated. <laughs> um, and uh, no one knows how to get off. They're not sure if we're on Earth. Sorry. There's big hints of mystery. Hmm. So. I'm glad you carried on from monsters that can be beaten. That's uh, this is going to be yet another violent, stumpy game. But it still may be. Hey. Uh, this is the nice person who uh, helped me when I was about to get murdered by a crab with a traffic cone on it. That was nice. Yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Very Doesn't excuse the headwear though, really. <laughs> Well, remember, they're on an island uh, where they have no way of getting off, so they're kind of limited to what washes up, I assume. <laughs> oh no, only a box of berries. So there's no overhead wear. You say you uh, you customize your own character. Do you deliberately make him look like the, the guy from That's a Special Kind of Stupid Memes? The beret? <laughs> oh, your guy. Oh, I don't know. I uh, I did it quick. I guess is the <laughs> honest answer. I was just like, uh, all right, cycled through fast and got it done. Oh, Normally she gave me the key. Okay. That's the high point of the game for me, really, just deciding what my guy is going to look like. Well, Here, I, I can get him to look like a problematic celebrity. I did learn you can go back and change it pretty easily, so I might uh tweak it when I'm not. On a Brodeo time limit. <laughs> Hell yeah! Right. Turn me into a monster again. <laughs> Wait a minute, you turn into a monster. Oh yeah, yeah. I was trying not to give it away, but she, uh, you know, she kind of did. <laughs> <laughs> Creep with the boots. What's wrong with his boots? Yeah, that's a lot of judgment from a beret. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Oh dear. So it let me pick between spooky and sweet at the beginning, and I picked sweet and got a candy devil form. Candy devil with some kind of karaoke powers. The amount of AP moves cost. Oh, okay. You get two AD a turn. Okay, good to know. So I guess I smack this dude. For a no, uh, for a no cost no AP, attack. Yeah, smack. It's always a good opening move. And then spit on oh. him. Do it. <laughs> spit on it's him. Got, it's got very Jerry spinning it very quickly. Oh, 
But what's it got to do with cassettes? Uh, so the cassettes are what allow us to turn into monsters. I see. Kind of an Evil Dead scenario. Yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> he plays the tape, they all turn into demons, everyone dies. Oh, he just actually just spared that guy. Yeah, full on. Hmm. Alright, uh... I guess I will blast him. And you... Spit on him again. <laughs> um, so, Steve, what have you been working on? Oh, I missed. Wonderful. What an excellent use of my uh, time and energy there. Oh, at least it doesn't charge you. I, I do appreciate that. You don't get, like, class points, so you don't lose anything. I know I'm going to uh, spit. I've, I haven't been working. Just keep spinning. Do it. You'll either win or you'll walk away disgusted. Yeah. Oh, he just ran away. I, I haven't learned if there's a cassette ball. Uh... He doesn't let him move. He's impressed. Alright, I wonder if the elevator switch is hidden back here. In this very noticeable alcove. It's where you put an elevator switch. Or, you know, maybe, like, next to the elevator, but maybe I'm just being crazy. Oh, cool. Okay, so I got a companion now. Uh, as for what I've been working on, a bit of Celebrity Meat Burger, but mostly, I don't know if you guys heard the news, but Shingles the Movie is now available on Amazon Prime. So what I've been doing in my spare time is telling everybody to go and watch Shingles the Movie on Amazon Prime. Uh, rent it, buy it, leave a review, uh, all those good things that will help the movie be seen by more people. And uh, yeah, I watched it again, even though I've seen it like quite a few times now, because it was a real kick to me that it had the subtitles. I don't know why, but I just found that very cool. Hey. See all of Jimmy Headshot's bullshit. <laughs> and, and normal words. Uh, well, while it's not, um, yes. I have a hundred wood. Oh, boy. <laughs> that is the worst chat line I've ever heard. Let's see if it works. <laughs> Removed. Four wood. <laughs> She's Irish. That explains the beret, then, I guess. For fuck's sake. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to defer to you on that one. <laughs> um, on the subject of what we're writing, uh, I'm of course still working on Villains Code 3, it's going to be a while, but you might notice that in our description, uh, one of the links have changed, and that is because I have a new book up for pre-order, Villains Vignettes Volume 1, is available in print and ebook on June 21st, uh, audio is, uh, booked, but date still to be determined, so I will let y'all know when I know. And, uh, yeah, that's a really fun one I'm super excited about. Snake! He's got a little wrestling mask. Aww. And an adorable companion. There's Spit a doggy. Now, now I want to capture the dog. Bow to me, dog. Oh, Sonic Boom. All right. We'll try Who that next. Who comes to help you? I haven't tried it yet. It only has a 50% chance, and I uh, have not played many of these games yet. <laughs> Air type attacks blow out fire types. All right. Uh, is that does that work? Because you know, air and fire doesn't always mean the fire goes out. Sometimes it just means the fire gets a lot less contained. Yeah, air, air I would not describe as the natural enemy to fire by any stretch no. of the imagination. <laughs> no, I think they've cocked up the um, the elemental <laughs> rock, paper, scissor there. <laughs> <laughs> now what his fire needs? Oxygen. <laughs> it will crush them! <laughs> crush them! <laughs> 
uh, in the chat, Katie Hughes said for lunch today, bangers and mash in Scotland. Hope you're enjoying your time in Scotland. Bangers and mash for the Americans. Uh, it's just sausages and mashed potato. It's fine. It's nothing weird. Now, of course, the minute you say it's nothing weird, that inherently makes us think it's weird. Well, I don't know what's in the sausage. It depends. Was it a very cheap bangers and mash or a fancy one? With real animal meat. From a named animal. No, no, I'm not here to judge. But I am. <laughs> As it's I murder this traffic crab. Off. As this... Is this just a guy who's dressed like a bat? I mean, I don't yeah. want to say a Batman, but... <laughs> no, and he's definitely for sex reasons, too. Oh, a thousand percent. I, I yeah. didn't even really need to be said. Now they'll dance. It's a deep, horrible truth. All right. Sonic Boom! Please don't <laughs> kill my buddy. <laughs> Chat says... Uh, honestly, thank goodness someone is trying to break open the stranglehold that Pokemon has on the genre. I don't know, is it... It's been a few contenders, right? I mean, it's weird how much... Well, Kaylee's dead. Oh, way to hang on there. Like, for as popular as the format is, you don't really see it utilized terribly often. I always loved uh, turn-based uh, fighting games. Turn-based, yeah, it's, I don't know, something about, like, the catching mechanic, the ability to change out your party, um, all right, I gotta burn some wood. That's, uh, why I stopped playing Final Fantasy games, all of a sudden, they're too good for turn-based. Well, you've lost a customer, Squaresoft, you billionaire idiots. Uh, Let's go see what this gentleman says, on the bridge is about. Bangers weren't cheap, and they were from a regular animal, so... Well done. Good for you. Oh. Before you leave Scotland, do try a black pudding. That's definitely not from a recognisable animal. I mean, if you can recognise it, where's the adventure? <laughs> It says this game is adorable. It is quite adorable. It has a nice graphic style. Yeah, it's very honestly fun and charming so far. I've been enjoying it. We were joking around uh, that it was basically the indie movie of uh, Pokemon games. It had a very distinct soundtrack. I'm going to guess this switch brings the bird over. Oh, I was joking. Okay. Oh, here it comes. Can I kill you? Can I become you? I want to wear your flesh. <laughs> Let me wear your flesh. Oh, okay. Yeah, here's our cassette ball, for lack of a better term. So you just record monsters and t t take their souls. Uh, sure seems to be that way. And then okay. we just wear it uh, Buffalo Bill style. We don't know how it works, but it does, and that's good enough. That's that's honestly smart <laughs> writing. A lot, a lot of these monsters do seem like. People dressed up in monster costumes. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> I want to know what's going on here, Drew. Uh, I guess I'm going to spit on it and then uh, record its essence. <laughs> yeah, you get limited to text. You can spit in his hair. Call him a bitch. <laughs> yeah, this is... Is this some kind of furry recruiting game? Come on, Jay, you can tell me. You know about these things. I, I don't uh, need the good fairies either. I mean the seedy ones. I got him! <laughs> Ominops. See? No. Oh, wow. Yeah, Ominops. that, uh... Now that I'm looking at it, it yeah. does look a little bit like a mask, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, could have been worse. Could have been a southern moth, I guess. That says, speaking of movies, have you seen the Mario movie yet? Yep, without a doubt, the most efficient... Uh, movie about Mario I have ever seen. I I'm very looking forward to seeing it. Apparently, I heard people on uh, Twitter got to see it early. <laughs> Apparently, someone leaked the whole movie for a few hours. Oh dear. Yeah. Well, it uh, still managed to make a billion dollars, so yeah. I don't think anyone was hurt by that. 
Oh, I do like that it doesn't get knocked out while it's being recorded. That That is nice of them. That's good. All right, so they're now trapped in the tape, and you can give them bonuses by putting stickers on it. Who is this for? Who remembers cassette tapes? I guess us? <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Okay. Now I have to become you. Uh, and you keep spitting. <laughs> Yeah, well, Sonic boom your ass. Why not? Yeah! Sack in the chat points out that I think the term for cassette ball should really be called the cassette deck. Yeah. I think balls is... I don't know, is that just to make Pokemon people feel a little bit more? I don't know. Or maybe they just wanted to say balls. I haven't worked out if this game's perverted or not yet. I'm after Dama Moth. I certainly know what direction I'm yeah. leaning. <laughs> There's a chance, Drew. There's a chance it won't be weird. Oh god! Oh god! I <laughs> have become Jesus! Is this oh, meant to I see. happen? What's happening? I thought that those uh, purple sunglasses he had, I thought that was his mustache. <laughs> well, you can now glide like a moth, of course. Well. Right. That stands to reason. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> that was a very blase sorry. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh, uh, did you not expect to get grabbed by elementals and thrust into the yeah. air? <laughs> well, I some... neglect to mention that when you eat something soul, you, you take on its attributes. Oh, well, those are the rules. Sorry, I didn't expect you to be such a weenie. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were cool, man. Whoa! <laughs> Chat also says hopefully Nintendo will send the Pinkertons to Elon Musk's house. Is that just what corporations are doing now? Well, I hope so. As long as they're, uh, you know, saving it for the boardroom. Uh, yeah, I was wasn't overly impressed with the Super Mario movie as a movie, but as a vehicle for injecting Mario-related experiences into my senses, uh, very efficient. Uh, ten stars. I guess we're going this way then. Yeah. Oh, everyone can fly. I did wonder why she was flying. That, I was too polite to ask. That did seem kind of cool. Uh, yeah. I assumed she was cooler than me. Yeah. The beret was a big hint. <laughs> yeah, that's why I didn't want to like, bring it up. I didn't want. I didn't want to know I was impressed. In case she thought it was because of the beret. keep looking for a, uh, uh, a poke of a center, uh, sorry, a wood pile, uh, so I can do some healings if needed. Oh well. Let's just go kill some stuff! Woo! Speaking of video game movies, uh, has there only been any Holy word crap. on the, the next Sonic the Hedgehog movie? What the hell is that? I don't know, but I want it! So uh, the nice cream on a statue. It looks cool. Oh, I forgot I had taken real damage and had not uh, regenerated after that. Well, that's not good. It's probably going to be fine. Air. Air attacks can uproot plant attacks. Well, that makes Sounds... more sense yeah, than the fire air. Sense. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I have to try it every turn. Well. Oh, crap. Okay. Well. Hmm. 
We'll try a smack. Uh, chance, Judy in chat says there will be a knuckle series. Leslie says, Ah, Sonic, looking forward to the Five Nights at Freddy's. Yeah, that's sure to be a money spinner. I'm only really interested in the Sonic movie because I'm interested in the fate of uh, James Marsden. I'm pretty sure he was he's done something to somebody in Hollywood and now has to star alongside animated creatures for the rest of his days. But nobody was banking on that, on these uh, movies suddenly becoming uh, successful, is my theory. So I wondered if he's going to be Will he get kicked out of the Sonic franchise? Will he finally be released? <laughs> oh my god, that would be <clears throat> such a such a kick in the teeth if they're like, yeah man, you uh <laughs> you you did you did great work, but unfortunately you did too great a work. Yeah. We put you here to punish you, but now people like these movies. And uh, if these are making money, well, obviously <laughs> we're not gonna waste it on you. <laughs> You have to go. You were the gen generic human character. You are easily replaced. How do you get demoted <laughs> after the Sonic movie? Okay. I'm starting to learn how this works now. I definitely should not have just used those uh, up in the front, but I did, and we're going to live with it. It's fine. It's fine. You got this thing now. Look at it. It's an idiot. We did it! We murdered it. Oh, thank God it gave us wood. <laughs> Murder always does. Murder conveys just so much wood. You felt that one, right? With all your wood? Uh, <laughs> we can, uh, if we could not fight that guy right now, that would be awesome. So, no, I got here today. Okay, yeah. I, I'm I'm my sense of weird has been blown out. I just turned into a candy monster. Yeah, she just. Oh well, at least you found something there. Oh boy, I guess I'm gonna really just hope this doesn't force us into a fight. Beauty Black says, after the last five nights at Freddy's game, I have low hopes for the movie. Uh, I don't think it has to be good. I think it's been around, what, good, like, ten years now? Maybe less than that. The point I'm making is, like, the people who came along in the original Five Nights at Freddy are all adults now and probably want an R-rated Five Nights at Freddy experience. So all they have to do is a, an awful horror movie, and they will make millions did you, uh, there was a Banana Splits horror movie that <clears throat> pretty well tread on the Five Nights at Freddy's <laughs> ground that was yeah. not great. There was a couple of them. They did the one with Nicolas Cage as well, where he didn't talk for the entire movie. I honestly kind of liked that one. <laughs> I thought if they got the action right on that and it hadn't been made by people, clearly never made a movie before, uh, I would have been fine. But you got Nicolas Cage fighting puppets and... You don't get Jackie Chan's choreographer in. <laughs> uh, oh boy, this seems bad. Oh, okay. Well, it's gone a bit strange now. Oh, awesome! Uh, That's great. another thing I don't have context for. Sounded sincere about that. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry, my candy demon can win. Uh, I've got a feeling this is one of those fights you're not supposed to win. Yeah, you think? Yeah. Well, let's see if a smack works against yeah, this I always, demigod. I always fall for it, Drew. I always end up like using all my sweet items. Trying to defeat the, the boss monster I'm clearly not supposed to defeat. I'm just gonna spit on you. <laughs> just keep spitting on it. Oh good, yeah. That... No appreciable difference. Ray Radar in chat says wasn't he in the movie Hop? 
Yeah, James Marston. He was in the movie Hop, and he's never escaped from that role. Was he ever meant to escape? No. That's why I'm curious to see it. I'm, I want to see what happens with Sonic 3. And where they can send him that's lower than that. Oh, of course it missed. Why would it hit? Amy Gilroy in the chat, hello. He says, Willy's Wonderland was its own thing and was great. I don't know. I think I would have liked to see Nicolas Cage have more convincing fights with puppets. I reckon like Nicolas Cage has more convincing fights with puppets just on his downtime. So a missed opportunity, in my opinion. To Elsa said, has anyone seen Renfield yet? No, haven't seen him. Do like Nicholas Watts' his face, the one that isn't Nicholas Cage, is a different Nicholas. He's very good in everything he's in. Nicholas Cage, of course, uh, has a track record for being an insane vampire. So yeah, I was excited to see it. Oh, are we unlocking the power of heart already? Oh, I was oh, nice. joking. <laughs> what the? F uh, That's worse. <laughs> I I look like a beaker. More powerful. Okay. You look like a really bad urine sample. Yeah, it's like a cup of coffee with a head on it. Uh. Mm. Does that does that really happen in like uh? When there's fusion in a cartoon, the people do it and they just go, Oh god no, this is a horrible mistake. This is awful. Let's let's not do this again. Uh let's see. I guess I should use my raise my attack thing. Good job, crab. <laughs> yeah, a little traffic kind. Hey, crab, whoa. I mean They don't play with Lego. The traffic cone crab, his job is to get hit, right? Oh, a hundred percent. Yeah. Yeah. He he's there to die for me. Yes. It looks what he's designed for. Although I, I'm not gonna be mad at him uh doing something that lets me survive. Oh, okay, the wall absolutely helped. <laughs> Good job, crab! Oh, I thought that was being sarcastic. No, no, no. no the, it, it ate a hit for me. Nice. Level 100 it may be. Particularly bright, it is not. Uh-oh. Okay. It doesn't know the power of crab. <laughs> it doesn't know the power of spitting in its hair. Alright, I guess I'll try and Sonic Boom it to death. That's yeah! Music is, music is perfect. This is good music. How did you beat the level 100 thing? Uh, it had almost no life. It, it was basically oh. on death's doorstep. Alright, okay. And we, oh. we still barely did it. <laughs> oh, okay, so she is also barely wondering. Either. Yeah. That's a problem because we just killed you. Mm. You seem absolutely trustworthy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very well. Oh boy. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're the demon now. Yeah. <sighs> what does this mean? I mean, I'm probably host to the main villain. Seems like the the thrust of it. Yeah, I mean, probably good, right? I mean, having an uncomfortable talk after fusing unexpectedly feels like a, a very yeah. <laughs> interesting way to code that. <laughs> yeah, like... Really, when we suddenly became the same entity, 
That was, uh... What I'm saying is, you're not pregnant, are you? Am I? <laughs> or am I? I don't know how this works. Very unclear about how everything on this island works. It's been a hell of a three hours for me. We should both get checked out. That's... Also, that is the worst fusion I've ever seen in any game ever. I mean, I'm glad it worked out, but it looked horrible. Sorry. <laughs> is that the one sorry they have for this character? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait until, like, she does something that accidentally causes the end of the world. Sorry. <laughs> Oh wow, even the even the writing of it uh powerful being. Oh uh, all right, game. <laughs> okay, all right. Sorry. Hey, we got a different sorry. I w I'm so I kind of wish we had though. No. Yeah. I wish we'd gotten the sorry. Max <laughs> <laughs> says that sorry is this game's excuse me, princess. Yeah. I, I feel like the feeling I'd be able to fuse with you again if I ever needed to. Like say if I texted you around two in the morning after being out <laughs> the bar and striking out. Am I supposed to be trying to bang these people? Yeah, probably. Is it like a Stardew Valley thing? Try and bang everyone? I don't know, I didn't play Stardew Valley. I tried it and I was not very good at it. Alright, well, you have to kill God okay. again! I'm gonna guess like five times, probably. Right. Build up the polycule. Get weird, kill God. Check. I'm in a rest. That says, have you heard of the strike? <laughs> Writers Guild of America strike, I take it, you mean. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, I have heard that they went on strike, and so, uh, obviously, full support to them. Hope they get what they're asking for soon. Uh, yeah, because, um, I don't know, we already had a lot of sort of not very good television from entertainers when COVID happened. I don't want to go through that again. They need writers. Yeah, it's interesting to think back of the last writer strike. It feels like it wasn't that long ago, but was it 2008? Yeah, it was a while ago. Holy shit. <laughs> I remember because that awful Brendan Fraser movie came out. Um... <laughs> The remake of Bedazzled. I thought this must be what happens when they don't have writers. I remember the second season of Heroes just going so far to shit. Well, I like that you're aware that you were screaming about that. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Gotta go stake out those guys, huh? I truly hope we get like a full-on Dracula dead and loving it where it's just an, a fountain of blood for like a solid minute. <laughs> <laughs> Eugene running around, Oh god, oh god, oh god, why won't it stop? <laughs> Where did he say to meet him? I was too busy laughing at him, if I'm being honest. Uh, yeah. Haha! -ha! Anyway, Can't stop I get me. I get the impression that guy's deferred, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
So you're new to the whole cassette tape transforming thing? Of course I am. Don't say it like it's a normal thing. That everybody was doing. It's your weird island. Ah, you're new to the whole jerking off and gaining invisibility <laughs> thing. What? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Why don't we chat this sticker mert? There's no one here! To the cave in the park to find some arts. Don't bring me into your side quests, merchant. Oh, well, all right. Well, that's still creepy. Uh, oh, eight parts of the song. Oh, I have to kill a lot of God. Yeah. Uh, meet Eugene at the outs here. Okay, that's where. What do you think? Let's go take on a a, a lesser quest. Yeah, sure. All right. some stickers. I need stickers. I'm hungry for stickers. Speaking of stickers, uh, tpublic.com, Orphans and Dragons. You can buy all our designs in sticker form. Unlike Did me, who's too you... poor to buy stickers. <laughs> do they give you special powers? I can't confirm that they do. The FDA won't let us say if our stickers <laughs> give you powers. <laughs> So ask yourself, who do you trust? The government? <laughs> or stickers? Yeah. <laughs> that, yeah, we should lean into that sales pitch. The government will tell you that you shouldn't buy Orphans and Dragons merchandise in sticker form, that it doesn't give you magic powers or improve any of your stats. I'm not giving you wood, buddy. I need this wood to live. My life wood. What is life? Reminds me of washing up here the same day. Because I did it this morning. <laughs> Ooh. What's up, Mr. Creepy person on the... Uh... Ooh, is that this game's equivalent of Mewtwo? Is he going to like... Is he going to be important later, do you think? Maybe. I honestly can't tell what it is. Probably gonna have to kill it and take a song from its soul or something. Yeah. But I mean... Ooh, I mean that's the way Amy I wanted to go. Says, Stick it to the man with stickers. <laughs> that's great. Sticker it to the man. Yeah. You've changed my mind about the writer's strike. We don't need writers. We could just come up with all our shit here. It's fine. Oh, man. Yeah, uh, I did see all the late night talk shows have uh, officially halted. Uh, yeah, I guess they need kind of like constant fresh material. Which they will need writers. Oh, I see Mr. Creepy again. But first I want to see what's in here. Mind you, didn't Conan O'Brien just keep it going last time when there was a writer's strike? Because he was just basically doing it himself. He did. He also, I think, paid his uh, staff out of his pocket while he was doing that. Ah, cool. Well, why don't I do that? Because not everybody is, is Conan O'Brien good. Mm. How do I well, get to you? Be. Oh, I guess I just have to go up here. <laughs> is that a clown snake? No, worse. It's some kind of chicken snake. I think I fought that thing earlier and did not care for it one bit. No. Oh, I should have bought more tapes. Oh, I don't know how to buy more tapes. <laughs> I'm also poor. It is the force of... <laughs> the forces of evil? I don't know. Maybe give me your jacket. I'd be confident about taking on the forces of evil too if I had a jacket like that. It is a pretty rad jacket. Yeah. Looks can be deceiving. See this jacket? I look like a badass. Nope. <laughs> gotten my teeth kicked in every night I've tried this. <laughs> Looked good doing it, though. All right. I mean, I wasn't worried about you bailing on me until you just bailed on me. <laughs> oh, that's... Is that a monster? Uh, a robot. I don't know that I like you as much as the Irish one. Oh! Mm. <gasps> There's another Mr. Creepy. Alright, we'll deal with you later. First, 
Let's kill some vampires! <laughs> or just some goth kids. Yeah. I'm ready for that Probably. twist. <laughs> it's just a clubhouse of people who rejected him. Oh. Well. Oh, Eugene. Yes. Eugene, you can fuck off. <laughs> okay, actually, maybe Eugene, <clears throat> I might be on your side with this one, buddy. <laughs> Yeah, what the hell? Sure. Reality has enough housing crisis. I'm not letting you bring one into this world. Ooh. Hell yeah. I'm gonna use the heck out of that when I get enough juice. Just raise arms me. Uh, that lets me boost my range attack, but I don't really, um, uh, have one. Well. Spring heal? More like... Ah, you turd. You flinching turd. <laughs> buried. Earth types bury plastic types. Didn't realize plastic was a type. Yeah, the uh the the consistency here is not as uh smooth as the uh plastic types. That's Well, I don't think that works really. Nope. <laughs> Oh no, Eugene! Not you! <laughs> I had so much faith in you right from the start. I wasn't bummed that I lost my uh, my good character and my, you instead. My competent one. Yeah. Yeah, no, you're way better. You're way better. So happy I have you, Gene. <laughs> See you, Katie, in chat. Enjoy Scotland. Uh, have some haggis. You won't enjoy it, but you can say you've had it. Unless you're hungover, in which case, fill your boots. Haha! -ha! I killed you, landkeeper! I'll teach you for trying to get in on the ground floor. And now you shall die! Maybe. Still figuring out how all this works. But I can hit you with my dog! Slap. Uh oh, bone cannon. Yay, that's what plant wall was for. Now, see, if earth type buried bone type, that makes sense, I guess. Well, plant implant seeds into earth type. This is way overcomplicated. Oh, damn. I, I get it, though. You, you have to distinguish yourself. <laughs> Yeah, like, legally, yeah. you have to distinguish yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Nintendo, do not fuck around. It's true. Hooray! Boop, boop, boop. Oh, good. Cloxley learned something. Thank Christ. <laughs> okay, they learn how, not how, how to not suck. Ooh, deep fried Mars bars. I've done deep fried Snickers at the State Fair, and I'm a big fan of that one. Never tried a deep fried Mars bar. I'm not sure I need a new unhealthy addiction. I've already got a few. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Now I can break it into roofs. Excellent. Oh, they They're love to trade gossip. Entry. Yeah, it does capture the reality of being stuck in a small town. I'll give him that. Hmm. God, I love talking about shit that don't concern me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we're going to head back to the Gramophone Cafe because you suck. <laughs> What's going on with his headgear in his... He doesn't look that lame when you actually see the picture of him. 
Yeah, it looks like he has a really terrible wig on. Yeah. Listen, buddy. I'm gonna... I gotta tell you. Between you and the Irish lady uh, with the beret, it's not even close. No. I can't get rid of him. I thought you'd successfully guided him off a cliff there, but... No, he just... He came back. Ah, there we go. Yes. And How about also, Eugene? Got a heal. <laughs> Listen, Eugene, I'm sure you're a great guy, but also I don't care. <laughs> you, <laughs> you got smacked hard down in combat. <laughs> oh yeah, mm. you you didn't realize that when we had to take on the flesh of other monsters to survive. I mean, I know I just washed up here today, but I wasn't born yesterday, lady. I think. I don't know. Actually. <laughs> I mean, what? Unless I was. Maybe. Nothing makes sense. <gasps> Trembling ground. Oh, nice. They give you a thing to track rumors. Oh, that's good. All right, let's go hunt for some hot goss. Yeah, hopefully something a little bit more personal next time. I watched the fisherman have sex with a cop. There we go, that's what we're talking about. That's not even gossip. <laughs> he does it every day in the town square at noon. Uh, it's not deep really fried, a town secret. Yeah. Deep fried Oreo, also an excellent deep fried option. I am a fan of sweet, disgusting goo. But no. I can never bring myself to go and ask for one. Well, if you ever end up at a state fair in Texas, I'm going to have a lot of questions. Um, <laughs> but we can also get you a... Uh, <laughs> A deep fried anything <laughs> truly deep fried anything I I'm trying to remember some of the standouts uh, through the years uh, in terms of concept if not execution like chicken fried bacon sounds better than it is um, fried butter fun novelty not really all that much flavor <laughs> uh, the fried Oreo though <laughs> that that was legit fried Snickers was great how much wood do you need looking. buddy Maybe I'm just looking for a new way to eat butter, Drew. Maybe that's all it has to be. As God intended. Oh, crap. Somebody was annoyed behind that tree. I would, yes, uh, I would record you, buddy, but I don't actually have enough left. <laughs> all right. I got like one left and I ain't using it for you. Do you have the his gimp powers yet? He's a gimp type. I yeah, assume. I ha I have not taken on Gimpmon yet, or Dommon, Wh whatever he's going by. Hmm. Probably uh, Sex Crime Joe is my honest guess. Sex Crime Joe keeps picking fights because he likes to get hit. Ooh, chat suggests a deep-fried Reese's cup. Oh, man. Oh, they've done those. Pretty good. Yeah, I tried to kill me. Joy. Kill you with joy. Mm. Uh, oh. Go into. I forgot I'm supposed to be Don't... tracking something. Quest log. There we go. Oh, well, I should have gone to that one, but I didn't. So now we're going to go try to take me on. We'll try and get there in the uh, time we have remaining. I think the next time I go out, rather than going to a bar, I'm just going to go to the seediest chippy and call me and just see what they will fry. Just bring, like, a bag of stuff with me. I'm going to be honest with you, Steve. I love that plan. Yeah. See who see who blinks first. <laughs> Deep fried Cadbury cream egg? Yeah, yeah. Now we're talking. Uh, 
try and make some sort of uh, deep fried treat to ducken. Ooh, I like that idea. A cream egg into a Kinder egg. Where do you go from there? Into a Scotch egg. Egg made of Scotch and for Scotch. Yeah. And Fry Sonic keep. Boom! Deep fried is soup. Oh He's no! A full meal out of it. That jerk used his plastic wall. This little uh, Duplo block wall. Yeah, it's the same thing that saved me. I don't know the Duplo blocks and the tongue hanging out. I feel bad about being this creature. <laughs> it's conveying a lot of <laughs> innocence at the moment. I already captured its soul. Yeah. What does it want, Mercy? Maybe it should have thought about that before stepping in my way. <laughs> Maybe you should have thought about that before asking for mercy. Oh. <laughs> God. That was weird. See your own death! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I... So obviously we're starting to come uh, close on time for Brody of. I have to say I am really enjoying the Dickens out of this one. This is a fun one. This is a nice. Uh, it's fun to watch. Uh, we should revisit this next time. We need a chill Brody. -er. There is a, a pretty good chance I will keep playing this in my own time. Well, you'll have to fill us in on the needlessly complex and weird story. Well, I mean that's whoa. Ah, uh, yeah, all right. I made it up here. I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to get up here, but I did. What's up? Are we buds, or are you going to fight me? <laughs> I'm waiting to get the intrigue out of the way. Oh, you can fast travel. I do appreciate that. Will we be able to reach? <laughs> It'd be great if you had a fast travel option. It's just a guy and he's like, hey, uh, you want to fast travel? You say, yeah. He just puts a chloroform rag over your face. <gasps> it's a spooky guy! Ooh. I'm guessing she is the uh, leader we're supposed to just be meeting up with. confident woman. Oh. He's a level eight. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm starting to see why she was confident! Yeah. I will give you confidence <laughs> if you can morph into some kind of Power Rangers beast and eradicate everything with your radon breath, then yeah, you're gonna be confident. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, Mecha Godzilla. <laughs> Meredith's kind of a bitch. Speaking as a farmer data analyst, go fuck yourself, Meredith. Yeah. <laughs> I've never called myself a scientist, but, uh... <laughs> <laughs> no, I was feeling okay about getting washed up here until I met you, Meredith. <laughs> Start to see why everybody hates it here. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I got another quest. Cool. That quest, avoid Meredith at parties. <laughs> it's a town quest. Right. Oh. Oh, crap. All right. We are All fighting. Right. I'm I'm really yeah, learning Gorobuds. this uh, slowly. Well, fight you then and spit on you. Just spit in your face. How dare you? Well, he did it first. <laughs> oh, you what kind of, what kind of animal does that? You pervert! <laughs> now that I've done it, because uh, you lowered the tone. Unforgivable. Yeah. No way you could have possibly known I was going to do that to you, so... Well, that's worse. You're yeah, double poisoned! Things. You can go back to, to spitting. That's, that's worse than... That's not as bad as being bitten to death. 
Aww. <laughs> That's some good voice acting, I like that. Chomp. That says, I wish I could just grow wings and fly away when I was done with the conversation. Oh. Well, if you were as rude as Meredith, then you can. <laughs> Hey, I've got Elemental Wall, and still no way to freaking, uh, I feel like she started with way more AP than most people, so, hmm. how did, what was her trick for that? Uh, Elemental Wall, so like, plastic is an element in this game, I guess. Right? It yeah, seems that okay. way. You can have a plastic wall, I guess you can have other kind of walls. Um, I think plastic is an element. I mean... Fuck, it might be. I'm not a scientist. Screw it. But are you a data analyst? <laughs> I'm not even that. Oh, shit. <laughs> what do you think will feed the void while the writers are on strike, says chat. Last time it was game shows. Last time we didn't really have massive amounts of uh, TikTok. So I guess it was just going to be um, people dancing. And that's why we really need to start paying these writers. We need to be safe from ourselves. And I'm not a social analyst, but I don't think that the answer to today's problems, wherever they may be, is more TikTok dancing. How dare you? Yeah, uh, it, it's definitely going to be interesting to see how this one shakes out. I mean, it does seem to be wildly overdue. We, we've known for a while that people were getting screwed on streaming, and given the uh, ridiculousness of HBO Max last year cutting tons of its own content to avoid paying royalties to the people that made it, like, yeah, this this does not seem like a, like a great system right now. <laughs> These are the same people who want us to pay them, like, eight bucks a month. Things I can quite easily steal. I'm not even, like, a uh, very technically good at stealing stuff. But, yeah. Pay your writers. Corporate people. Alright, one more fight. Let's go for it. And then we'll be able to confront the confident lady who will absolutely annihilate us. Yeah, yeah. Just, just burn through our souls. Maybe keep a civil tongue in your head for that, for that first meeting. <laughs> yeah. Uh, chat suggests just repeats of the Great British Bake Off. Yeah. Yeah, probably. All bad then. <laughs> yeah. Charles says, remember LimeWire? Yes, that was probably the last time I actually stole anything off the internet, which goes to show um, what a out-of-touch internet criminal I am. Unforgivable, Steve. Yeah, I know. I pay for these things. I pay for things these days. Yes. Like a, like a gentleman does. Writers, uh, software... You know, I pay for stuff. Parking. Parking. My mistakes. <laughs> My, oh, no, not that last one. <laughs> oh, that's a nerd one. Boo. <laughs> oh, yeah. My Domamoth uh, has gotten stronger. Oh, dear. Mm. Oh, boy. All right, folks, uh, that is going to be where we call it for Brodio this week. Thank you so much for joining us. We hope you have enjoyed Cassette Beast. I've had a lot of fun playing this one, so maybe we'll revisit it in the future. Yeah, this has been nice. Indeed. Uh, until, ne until next time, I have been Drew. And I have been Steve. And we will uh, see you next time on Adventure Brodio. Bye. Bye.